Trey T. It's your boy D. Neil back with another reaction video, guys. Here we are with Americans love UK accents. Russell Howard going to America. Before we dive in, make sure you subscribe to the channel, ring notification bell, get a video a thumbs up so it gets suggested. What we got, Russell? So he's the stand-up comedian who brings more good news to the screen than Krishna and Guru Murphy on a disco biscuit. It's the very <laughs> funny Russell Howard! <laughs> I'm very well, how are you? Good. Well, now, we've got to talk about your new series, mm. Russell Howard's Good News. Yeah. Starting mm. back on BBC Two a few a few weeks ago now. Yes. Now, listen, the news is so grim right now. I mean, you've got Syria, you've got, like, the refugee thing, you've got fucking 5p for a carrier bag. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if I had to rate the world on TripAdvisor, I wouldn't even give it one star. Can I just say that? It must be tough, A, for you to find news to get comedy out, and then good news. I mean, please. But there are little bits of wonder in the world. Like, there was a story the mm. other day from Barnsley. A bus driver, his bell had broken, and he left oh. a sign on it that went, no bell, just if you want to stop, shout ding ding. <laughs> 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 Right, we're reversing everybody. <laughs> B, B, B. <laughs> so the snippet, and also I think I think a lot of people are interested in politics these days. Like yeah. we did a mm. thing about um, the NHS, and it went mental because yeah, exactly because because you know people are really I think particularly young people they're kind of fascinated and they want to protect the NHS, and they were probably slightly pissed off that MPs had an 11 percent pay rise mm. in the same year that they're trying to give them a pay cut. Yeah. So. You know, yeah, I, I, I definitely love the fact that uh, Russell Howard gives, he gives news in an entertaining way. Like, so you're learning, but you're also being entertained at the same time. Absolutely love that about uh, Rus the Russell Howard album. You know what they need to do? Leave, leave the doctors alone and start charging these perverts who turn up to A&E with it stuck up them. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> I love Alan Carr, bro. I Thank love you. the idea that somebody at home sat up just trying to eat a potato <laughs> just as you said that. <laughs> <laughs> Rumours that on. you're taking good news to America. Can you confirm mm. or deny? I can deny them. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't think it would. Uh, I don't think it'd work. I'd like to do it, but uh, no. Nah, I think they've they've got enough kind of comedy news shows. You should go. They should take this show. Really? No. Yeah. Come yeah. on. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Chatty guy. Gigging <laughs> in America is amazing. Well, I've, got, so... I've, got, I've got doing a few gigs next year in New York, but I'm just terrified. I don't know, because they're like New York, they're like, hey, asshole, move on. <laughs> <laughs> really? They'll, they'll absolutely love you. Why would they not? And they love the English accent. It's just, I was yeah. in a bar in New York, and this one was like, you're English. Oh, my God, say something English. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to say. And I just went, probably. <laughs> <laughs> and she honestly went, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it goes down. Uh, but we do love UK accents. Like, I, we love accents, bro. We love accents. Like, I love a UK accent. I love an Australian accent. Like, accents are, are I don't know. Accents different than ours. We just find and we're fascinated by. It's, it's great. Because you know what I get when people say, hey, where are you from? And you go, Northampton. <laughs> and then they must think everyone is Northampton. <laughs> like, Hello, welcome to Northampton. <laughs> <laughs> Of like, ah! <laughs> like a seagull trapped in a lift. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh, I'm talking of American and lifts. I had a very bizarre. I was in a lift with two two Not ladies. With Solange. No, no it was listen to this. This is. <laughs> it, was, it wasn't a million miles away. I was in Washington, and uh, there was two ladies, probably about fifty, and one of the ladies was squeezing the other lady's boobs, and I panicked, didn't know what to say, and went, "What's going on here?" Right? <laughs> and this lady generally turned to me and went, "It's her birthday." Right? <laughs> Oh, I've never had that kind of celebration <laughs> with my friends. We're having a great night. Yeah, Terry, there you go. <laughs> well, it's, it's amazing. It's a great place to gig. They're so buoyant and happy. They uh, cheer anything. It's brilliant. Oh, well, that's good. Now, this year, as you may know, I don't know if you know this, but I was um, seagull number one in a SpongeBob SquarePants movie. <laughs> the 17th highest grossing <laughs> film in the world. Check it out. <laughs> Check it out on Wikipedia, haters. <laughs> you're going to do acting yourself. Yeah, you've acted yeah. in something already. What's it called? Gertlush? It's called A Gertlush Christmas. Yeah, I wrote a film and, um, yeah, it's on at Christmas. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, should be all right. So Pretty tell good. us what's it about mm. then, this Gertlush? Wagwan, tell me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <lovely. clears throat> I love you so much. Um, um, it's a y'all gotta tell me is is the movie good? Did y'all enjoy the movie? If you've seen it, going home, uh, bring bring a I bring my character Alan. My character <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, brings a girl home for Christmas, and his family are mental and much hilarity in shoes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, um, yeah, it's good. It's good fun. Now, what's your family like? Because you say they are me are they mental? Mental? Yeah, they're yeah. lunatics. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, it's, there's, there's, no, there's no cutting around it. They're mad. Like my mum, <coughs> my mum loves the fact that I'm famous. And we were, we were on a motorway recently. There was a crash ahead of us. This bloke got out of the car, genuinely, knocked on the window, went, Excuse me, are you Russell Howard? Can I have a photo? Which is fairly weird. And yeah. my mum genuinely went, Help! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, understandably, why did you do that? And my yeah. mum, because I'm 57 and I don't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Well, that's what Take a look at Russell in the brilliant A Gert Lush Christmas. I bet you're just writing down what I'm Yeah, yeah. Now, are you getting excited for Christmas? I think things are starting a bit too early. Do you agree with me? All the Christmas yeah. bloody things. Yeah. Enough already. I know. Uh, no, I, I love Christmas, but. It's too early now. It's too early. It is. Have you seen the John Lewis advert? Did you cry? No, I thought it was deeply creepy. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that's, not, that's not heartwarming. That's giving an old man a telescope looking at a little girl. That's grooming. It was horrible. <laughs> I thought it was the most depressing. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yeah, I never mm -hmm. thought of it like that. Oh no, that spoiled it for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> At all. Well, I don't know if it is dodgy, but listen, we've got it here. Let's have a little look at the uh, John Lewis advert. You tell me if you think it's sinister. I don't think so. Here we go. Let's have a look. You'll have to world away. You'll have to world away. That was absolutely hilarious, bro. Uh, that's a better version. <laughs> Who wouldn't want to see that? I know, I know. I know. Uh, good luck with Gert Lush. Thanks, man. When's it on? It's on at Christmas, and I hope you enjoy it. I, I enjoyed doing it. It's very nerve-wracking, because um, it's the first time I've done something like that, but I, hopefully people will like it. Oh, I'm sure they will. Now, you're also doing a mini-tour over here. Yep. Where are you going? When's it starting? Tell me everything. OK, I'm doing, uh, I'm doing some gigs at the Albert Hall in March next year. And good luck with good news. And good luck in America. Oh, yeah! <laughs> yeah! Russell Howard, everyone! <laughs> Don't go anywhere, because after break, the brilliant Little Mix will be chatting and performing live right here. I'll see you in part four.
Oh, I absolutely love Alan Carr and Russell Howard, bro. That's all we got. You guys got a favorite video suggestion? You can subscribe to Patreon and drop it in the comment section. It's your boy, Junior. Out.